What's up guys, Apple have just finished their latest keynote in San Francisco announcing the iPad, uh, the iPad 2, sorry, uh, and they've been telling us about the features, the hardware specs and the prices. So I'm going to quickly run through what was announced earlier on today. So the first announcement was that they're going to be using the new A5 processor, which is now going to support dual core, uh, and it's up to, going to be up to two times faster CPU and up to nine times faster graphics, and it's going to be the same blow power as the A4, so that's going to give it a, quite a big kick uh, in that department. Uh, the next announcement was the fact that it's going to have front-facing and rear-facing cameras, uh, so that's obviously now going to support FaceTime. The new iPad is actually 33% thinner than the previous generation, which is amazing. As you can see from the image, it is a massive difference in the size. Um, and the current generation iPad is 13.4 millimeters thin, and the new iPad is 8.8 millimeters. And for the people out there who have got an iPhone 4, the iPhone 4 is actually 9.3 millimeters, which and the iPad 2, as I said, it was 8.8, .8, so it's actually thinner than your iPhone 4, um, and that obviously has an impact on the weight. So the current generation is 1.5 pounds, and the new iPad is going to be 1.3, which will be a bit easier on the hand if you're reading it or holding it for long periods of time. And the iPad 2 is actually coming in two colours. It's coming in the white and it's coming in black. Personally, I think the white looks a bit cheap. Uh, would you buy a white iPad or would you buy the black iPad? The battery life is the same, 10-hour battery life uh, and with over a month standby time. Also, the new generation iPad is going to have a H HDMI out. Uh, so as you can see, up to 1080p, works with all apps, supports rotation. Uh, so you can output that now to a TV device. The new iPad is coming out with iOS 4.3. And then as you can see here, the prices are in dollars. Obviously, I'm in the UK, but you can see here coming in three different models, 16, 32, and 64, and a Wi-Fi and a Wi-Fi 3G model. Okay, so you'll actually be able to buy the iPad. Uh, if you're in the US, you'll be able to buy it on the on March the 11th. Uh, for anywhere else, it'll be March the 25th. Uh, so are you going to order one? Do you currently own an iPad? Are you going to sell your iPad to buy an iPad 2? So that was just a quick rundown of the announcements from Apple today in San Francisco. So please leave any comments. Are you, like I said, are you going to buy the new iPad? Are you going to sell the I your current iPad to buy the new generation? What do you think to the specs? Do you think they could be better? Uh, so as usual, thanks for watching. Like I said, leave the comments below. Please subscribe and I'll catch you in the next video.